So we just arrived in Grahamstown where we're going to split into two groups and do two different shoe drops this morning and then go off and do a third shoe drop um, and then open a library which Dunlop has sponsored for one of the schools. <laughs> I think last night went a long way to kind of bring us all together as a group. Uh, we had a little little party together, which was great fun. The band were awesome. Um, so I think everyone's just feeling a lot more like a, a bit of a family, uh, having a great time together. It's awesome. <laughs> Lads, I'm jumping! Here we go. Yeah, cool. Thanks. so radical how on the first few days everyone's quite weary don't don't know about everyone not too sure kind of sticking to their own little clique and then before you know it it just develops into this whole like family it doesn't taste like nostalgia though which is what everyone told me it would taste like it just tastes like delicious Shoe drops are pretty much pretty much the same. First shoe drop, everyone's learning how the processes work, how we can make, make it quicker to get the shoes on the kids' feet. And then um, by the second shoe drop, everyone just knows which tasks they prefer, whether they want to fit the shoes, whether they want to go and fetch the shoes, or, um, or actually just entertain kids on the side. So everyone actually fits into a role that they enjoy most and, and the whole shoe drop works. It's awesome. Just play your dress, play your dress, oh.